All right, welcome back to Lemmings World Tour, everybody. So, last episode was uh, was quite a doozy, wasn't it? We got... well, we didn't. I got stuck on Bane of Boomerang for quite a while, and probably a lot longer than I should have. Because, all in all, that really wasn't a super difficult level. It was just I could not see the solution for the life of me. But we only have five professional levels left, so... Let's try and finish them all in this video, shall we? So, first of all... Down in Mexico, by the coasters. Well, this looks freaking awesome. Man, he's just... Strato's just pulling out, like, all the stops for the location levels, aren't... isn't he? So we can kill two lemmings, and holy cow, what is the, those octagon... Well, not octagon, those hexagons on the left. Well, how did you make those? What tile set are those from? So I know this is Mexico, obviously. We've got some nice ruins here. One way down arrows all throughout that, so it looks like we'll be using our miners there. Or at least a miner there. Okay, okay. So already, I can see holding the lemmings in is going to be... It's going to be tricky. Actually, no it won't. No it won't. We'll use the digger plus the bomber. Heck, we might not even need to use the bomber. We'll just wait and see. We probably are going to need to use the bomber, but maybe not. Actually, yeah, we're going to need to use the bomber. Sorry, buddy. Alright, now here's the tricky part is... What I would... What my plan was, was... Climb, mine, have another climber go up and mine the opposite direction. But how do we get the other living? I think I know how. We'll do that, and so when we pull up, it won't be that big of a deal. Also, I need to make sure. Oh, well, I don't want them that close together. Yeah, if, it, if they're that close together, it ain't gonna work. Which means I need to delay sending him as a climber, I think. Ooh, or alternatively. So first off, we could send a glider right out of the hatch, and he goes all the way up there, so... Instead, we're going to let one woman go this way. Then we're going to dig down. And we're going to pray that we can... Pit. Maybe we can't create the holding pit that easily. Hmm. Oh, that's a shame because this would be really nice if we could get this to work.
Yeah. And we can't afford to let him die, because the guy who goes back to mine is going to die. Hmm. Alright. much distance between these two guys as possible. That's not going to be enough. I need him to mine from far enough back so he'll turn around in the miner tunnel. And well, that, that just ain't gonna happen. Unless we could bash through the top and then just mine from right. But that would require us from would require us to bomb from such a high enough place that people would... Hmm. This is a tricky first level, make no mistake about that. I don't think it's possible that, yeah, we can't dig from such a place that we can if we get a lemming to climb up. Oh, that does work. Cool. I just didn't bomb from far enough forward. So we wait for him to turn around, and then we move. So now what we can do is send a floater, or not a floater, a glider. Ah, uh, let's wait a little bit more for that. Actually, we might as well mine from far enough back, like here. Now nah, we gotta mine from far forward than that. So he's unfortunately gonna mine all the way through there and die? Sorry, little them. That's okay, because you've lined up enough so that it, the others can all go to the exit. That was a cool level. I... The bombing in the digger tunnel was a little... precise for my liking, but... I'm gonna give that a pass. It looked very nice, and it was a cool solution, so... yeah. I like that one. Unfortunately, that took up 10 minutes of our time. Alright, level 37, Son of Jamaica. This is by Goombay Dance Band. Okay, not the Goomba Dance Band, Goombay Dance Band. Alright, we can kill one lemming this time, and we got Beach Meets Rock. Ooh, with that lovely looking waterfall area. That looks sweet. So, are all the lemmings going to be swimmers then? No, but we have a swimmer. And that's Splat Height.
resting? Hmm. This is actually going to be tricky. How am I going to keep the lemmings held? Oh, I know. Oh, that's super clever. I was literally just thinking, why do we even have a stoner on this level? But I'll tell you why we have a stoner on this level. Okay, that's actually super clever, because now we can platform over here and keep them penned in. How awesome is that? Yeah, Mom, that's pretty awesome. Alright, so this is the part we're going to need to send up the swimmer. I think I see where this is going. So now I can send up a swimmer. Beautiful. Our final basher, because our other last one has to be used from the point back there where we can free the lemmings. Too high. Oh, this is a really cool level. I really like this one. That trick at the beginning was fantastic, I will say. Because I was literally thinking, like, wait a second. How can we hold the lemmings back? And why do we have a stoner? And then they just clicked. That was fantastic. Big fan of that one. Really cool architecture, too. I love the waterfall area. Yeah! Alright. That... <laughs> That was just amazing. I really like that one. Great level for t uh, the end of the rank. We are on level 38. Ovo Jabalkin. This is by Milan Stankovic. Alright, this is just... We're going all over the world. Look at all those flags. We've got five lemmings that can be killed on this level. Alright. The Balkan route is infamous for remaining landmines from the war in the 90s. Watch your step. I think they're also still, like... In Germany, or like Europe, or, or some place in Europe, like they're still digging up landmines that were set in for World War Two, and apparently it's like that's not uncommon. So I was like, oh yeah, just let people know, and we'll come and get it. All right, so we got our nice little circus boat. Not very many skills. Alright, for a level like this, I like to go ahead and see which skills are necessary in which places. We could use a digger right there, and that would help simplify things, I believe. Actually, we could probably use a digger in two different areas. Believe it or not, the zero floaters and zero gliders is actually going to be pretty tricky on this level. I see those landmines. So we can let five lemmings die, and we have a cloner, so there are one, two, three, four... There are actually five landmines at the end. So we can let the five die there, use the cloner, and use the bomber, so... We don't even have to worry about getting past the landmines. How about that? A single basher or a single miner can get us through this part. We're gonna need a builder to get us out of the boat. That much is certain. Or maybe not. 
we could also platform and bash them out. I mean, I don't like that idea, but then again, we can't get through here without going up through the top, so we're going to have to use both of our builders there. This part's worrying me a little bit. I actually think what we need to do is dig at the end first. Or maybe not. The steel block there is just screaming, hey, you know what I'm used for? I'm used for digging here. And plus, that's, then we can just bash through the end. Oh, cool. That's less cool, though. Alright, I'm not sure where all my diggers are going to be used, so let's use one here. This is just so he won't splat on his way back. So we've got a bunch of miners and only one basher, so I say use the miner to get them through. This part's going to be tricky, because I wanted to go under here. But if I do that, I can't find a way to stop him. I have free platformers left. That would probably be enough to go up for the top, unfortunately. How thick is this steel block? Okay, more than six. So they can't walk up for the steel block if we made like a pixel bend. Okay. Good to know. Good to know. a way... Oh, there is a way we could platform at the end instead of cloning. And that will also turn him around. That's better. But let's also clone him, too. Alright, my plan is getting set in motion. Alright, so Mr. Cloner Guy over here I just realized, can we spare a basher somewhere? We can. If we can spare a basher, I want to spare a basher. Because the other basher we've used, or maybe we only have two for the start. Yeah. Let's call him. Hmm. 
Nah, he turns around. That's not good. Not super sure what my plan is here. Alright, well, my plan is essentially let him, let this guy blow up the hole so the basher stops bashing. <laughs> I didn't want you to platform that much. Doesn't feel super intended, but maybe. Oh man! Oh no! If only there was a way to get him to turn around earlier than that. Maybe there is. Oh, how about that? All right. So we can only kill five more lemmings, which means all of them have to be for the land mines. Which means, turn him around. Will we actually save a miner at the end? I believe we will, so he'll turn around and now we can bash the rest out. And now they'll all walk to the exit. Well, Lord willing. Oh no, they won't. That was too high for them to go up. And that's one way. There we go. That'll help. Yeah, they can definitely make it up that. Turn around, now we can let them all out. Whew. Since I have a miner left over, I'm not sure how intended that was. I feel like I did a lot of it the way that you're supposed to, but maybe not all of it. 
But Strato will probably leave a comment behind letting us know. I wonder if those landmines... Oh, yeah. The landmines were a reference to uh, people finding landmines from the 90s. <laughs> that was a fun level. It was pretty tricky sussing out the solution, but that was very good. I like that one. On to the next one. We're on level 39 in the second to last level. Taja, 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 Tajmi. All right, Rocky Horror Picture Show. Okay, once again, we can kill five lemmings. Oh, wow. So the lemmings are just doomed right from the start, unless we have a stoner or some gliders. We have one glider. Okay. <laughs> oh, fun. Well, platformer for the end. So we can't bash through all of that. That's a shame. But then again, we wouldn't be able to bash through it from down here either. But then again, if we went all the way down, we could platform across and uh, fence up. That would only take one destructive skill. And it looks like we're going to need quite a few destructive skills. Alright, so how far down can they fall? Alright. They can fall down to the second pedestal. We can't afford to let a lot of them die. Which isn't fantastic. Actually, maybe holding them back would be the best course of action. Will we need the digger anywhere on the level? I'm not sure. I don't think we will, actually, so... Let's just seal them in. Do that, and now we fence them up. Let's max out that release rate. We're gonna need that. All right, I'm gonna. I'm here to say, if we can get up the top part, that would be just... That would be great. Oh, yeah, yeah, With two bashers left, we can just... Oh, this will be nice. We don't even have to go the lower route, which is what I was afraid we'd have to. Instead, we can just do this. And now... Now everyone should be able to go right to the exit. Well, that was a surprisingly simple level, actually. Much easier than the last one. 
And I saved it two extra lemmings, and we had several building skills left, so that's pretty cool. Alright, one last level of the professional rank. I wonder what it will be. It will be an error message. It will be literally it crashed the game. Got to break out task manager again. Okay, so we're back, and clearly this last level is going to have, like, tons of tile set mixing. Because it literally crushed the game. Holy cow, yeah. We're on level 40, Queen of Chinatown by Amanda Lear. We gotta save everyone this time, and wow, I don't recognize most of these tile sets. Like, at all. Maybe these are some... Oh, I, I recognize, like, the hazard sign to the left. That's from the Wasteland tile set from Lemmings Plus 4. But the rest of these, I don't know. But let's go to Chinatown. I recognize the China flag. Very nice. You got the little star there. Very few skills here. So clearly we've got to use our builders to our advantage. Oh, is this what we're going to do? Okay, well, first of all, we need to trap, or hold, not trap, we need to hold the lemmings back. Digger seems like the perfect way to do that. Alright, so we can do that. Actually, let's do something like this. Now I need to keep in mind, I do need a basher to get them out. Which means that actually won't work. got a little tougher. I feel like builders we don't need that many of. So let's do that. Oh, also if we dig from such a point we can send a climber up out and potentially have two lemmings over here. So we need a basher to get through there, and I wanted to use like a builder after that so everyone can get out. And then we can use a basher there, and then we would have one basher left. And unfortunately, we can't afford to allow him to walk up the tree. Actually, a really quite tough level. Hmm. Maybe we can use this end part to our advantage of like the tree. Because what we could do is we could go over the top of the tree, bash build again. 
that would be four of our builders. Yeah, you know, let's try that. Alright. Oh no, that would be all of our builders, because I've got up that part. Curses. Those look like a different color, which is interesting. Oh, we can't even climb up. Whoops. How about this? Instead of uh, doing that, we bash. Okay, well, that doesn't work. That was a good idea. Just poorly executed. Okay, instead of bashing, we do build. However, now we bash here. Build inside the tree. Pray to God that this works out somehow. That's not gonna work out somehow. Is there a way? We could bash so that it doesn't take off any of that bridge. The answer is... no. Oh, okay. Holding back the lemmings, that's gonna be the tricky part, I think. safely trap them. got to try some new stuff. Here's something. Okay, no. Those are on the same vertical passage. I just wanted to make sure. <laughs> what if we were to do this? First off, yeah, they can survive. All right. So if we do that, and don't let him fall off the cliff, but instead do that. We're out of diggers, but if we build... That also turns us around. Aha! Hmm, so if we could keep a builder for the end of it. Perhaps that is what we need. So if we try something like this... Bash for the tops of their heads. Now if we build from back here... Let him climb. I forgot you can turn with the ceiling. 
Because again, in new Neolemics, ceilings are solid, or are deadly. So first off, yes, they can survive that, I believe, just barely. But more importantly, we can do that. Wow, okay, that was really tricky, just getting through the terrain. Whew! That one was hard, particularly if you're used to new Neoemix physics, because this is the old version, and in the new version, you could not build and turn around on the ceiling. The ceiling would literally kill you, which I think makes no sense at all, but uh, clearly some people thought otherwise, so I actually like the solid ceilings. Anyhow, that's it for the professional rank. We are done. Next rank is the D.Va rank. So from now on, we have D.Va, Rockstar, Legend, Encore, and Groupie. So we have five ranks left. So I'm definitely going to complete the D.Va rank. After that, I might take a break from this Let's Play. It really depends on how I'm feeling about playing more uh, Lemmings or not. If I'm still like, yeah, bring on more levels, then I'll also complete the Rockstar rank, and that will leave three ranks left. And I've heard that some of those are really, really tough. So... Maybe that's better, because if I complete the D.Va rank and then take a break, I will have essentially cut the levels in half. I do half of the levels for the first part of the LP, and then I, when I come back to it later, I'll do the second half. Or, alternatively, I could do the first five ranks and save the first three ranks for later, in which case that actually might break up the episodes more evenly. I'll, but we'll just have to wait and see on that. Thanks for watching, everybody. Tune in next time. We're going to be a diva, I suppose. And we might only be able to get through four levels, or maybe even only three levels per rank. We'll just have to wait and see what happens. Until we meet again, my friends, have a great day, and God bless.